Our next book on the Friday Night Author Roundtable, an interesting book. I'm excited to find out more about. The book is called Jasmine's Journey to Jesus, A Story of Brokenness, Pain, and Redemption by author L.T. Sutton from Christian Faith Publishing. L.T., thank you for being on the show. Thank you for having me. Now tell everybody a, a bit about this story. So the book takes you on a journey with a young woman. On the surface, she appears to have it all together. She's single, attractive, educated, with a fantastic career. But her emotional and spiritual well-being are a different story. By looking at her, no one would be able to tell she endured years of sexual abuse and poverty as a child and then she was raped even after she came out of that abusive situation. She faced issues of drug and alcohol abuse, unplanned pregnancy, and abortion. So this girl was put through the ringer and managed to survive it and not become a statistic. But she wasn't equipped to truly deal with what was going on inside of her to heal and thrive. She was kind of functional, but one could say she was living a double existence. So at some point her inner turmoil and you know her other demons reached a point where they no longer existed in the background, they began to plague her until they almost ruined her life. And it's during this time that she finds Jesus Christ. And through the story, you begin to witness her transformation. First, spiritually, you know, you begin to see her understand how things worked in her life, how sin played its part. And then you begin to see her see things through God's eyes and see her life through God's eyes. And you begin to just see her transform and, you know, it manifests in her life and her decisions and her walk. So it's it's a page turning testimony of how, you know, a true and meaningful relationship with Christ can bring you out of your darkest place. And it shows how he can break generational curses and stop patterns of bad decisions as a result. And, you know, things that we do because we just simply don't know better. Now, what inspired you to to write this story? It's a fictional story, but most of her experiences are my own. And her transformation I wrote about is very much like my own as well. In this book, I didn't spare the ugly details of her rape, her abuse, and the other horrible experiences because they were mine. And I wanted to be real and relatable to people who are going through and struggling with the same things. And I've gotten feedback from people who have read it and said, you know, I know someone who's going through this and they bought a copy for that person. So I would like it to be something that anyone who's going through this can relate to. Now, how was it working with Christian Faith Publishing to, to get this story out there and then get this book published? Um, it was an amazing experience, given that this is the first book I've ever published. You know, they walked me step by step um, through the process of getting it published, you know, editing art, everything. I mean, it was really amazing. I felt like they held my hand through the whole process, and it was just a wonderful experience. Now, is this something you'd like to do again, maybe down the road, a follow-up to this or another book uh, along a different line? Yes, I actually have a series in mind with Jasmine. Um, I'm already working on the next book, because in this book, you you kind of see her journey and that she gets saved, but the next one will be kind of a now she's, she's saved, and then now what? You know, I want to show how just because you get saved, your problems don't just go away. You know, you're just better equipped to deal with them. You have the authority, you know, God and the Holy Spirit behind you to battle those demons because they will keep coming back. And so that's what I want to deal with in the next book. Oh, excellent. We look forward to that. Now, now this book, Jasmine's Journey to Jesus, when, when people do read it, what do you hope is the most important message they get from reading the story? I want people to know that he can pull you out of your darkest place and bring you to a place of life that he can heal your heart, he can heal your soul, he can heal your mind and turn your life around. And, you know, he wipes our slate clean so that we don't have to wrap our identity and existence around our failures and how others failed and hurt us. I want people to understand that no matter what it is they come from, they can truly thrive and not just exist. This book, I think, is going to be a great read, and I think uh, everyone is really going to learn a lot from this. The book is called Jasmine's Journey to Jesus, A Story of Brokenness, Pain, and Redemption by author L.T. Sutton from Christian Faith Publishing. You can get your copy today, Amazon.com, Barnes & Noble, iTunes. Those are just a few of the locations online as well as at the brick-and-mortar stores. And L.T., thank you for being on the show. Thank you so much again for having me. Now on the Friday.